Right. So, all right. So, so, so let's get into the quote. All right. And the quote goes, you know, it's paraphrased sort of like this, where a young gentleman was talking to another fighter. <laughs> and he says, you know, you ever, uh, you ever took a laxative pill? You know, and, <laughs> and 20 minutes later, you know, it just runs through you. You know, that, that, that's, that's how I'm going to run through him. And that is said by none other wait. than Derek Chisora <laughs> to Dylan White. <laughs> Roll the tape. Have you ever taken those pills, the laxative pills? You know, the ones you take, you pop, and you wait for 20 minutes, you go to the toilet, and they go through you? Mm -hmm. I'm going to go through this man. It's a bit of a weird analogy. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta take my damn glass. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Bro told him, I'm gonna run through you like a laxative pill, bro. But, yeah. <laughs> I guess. Pause. I guess. Super ball. Super ball. <laughs> I guess. I guess. Don't do that. Can we, can we, can we move on now? <laughs> can we move on now? Can we go? Can we go? Oh, man. Can we proceed? <laughs> yeah, let's, let's do it, bro. Let's get into it. All right, I, 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 after I, I'm, you can't really say too much after that, right? Yeah. <laughs> what? Anyway, Thanks. all right. So let's jump into it, man. Without too much clowning around. First topic. So somebody suffered a big loss, and it wasn't a, a boxer. Or I mean, I guess he fancies himself a boxer in his part time. But uh, Conor McGregor got them hands uh, on Saturday. Uh, repeatedly in the face. Mm -hmm. And um, Mayweather uh, commented, uh, nobody wants his leftovers, pretty much trying to kill Pacquiao's money, you know. But uh, I think McGregor did a pretty good job on that on his own. Did 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 McGregor lose him, like, kill the pack fight, in y'all opinion? Go ahead, I'll, I'll let you take that. Go ahead, J.D. Hey, man, it most definitely killed the fight, man. In, in, my, in my view, my estimation... Um, that that fight is is null and void at this point, man. It's and it, from Straight all accounts, hands. it sounds like even according to Connor that the fight was set to be made if if he handled business, messed up the money, right? Yeah. So you gotta you got you gotta imagine you know Pacquiao in the Philippines, you know, kicked up with Jinky, you know, got the you know the, five, the five children running around the living. Hey, time, room. time, time, time. You know what he did? He was going to fight me. He, he, he just fight, fight me. <laughs> he should have just fight me. <laughs> yeah. like mad right, right now. Right. So, so you can imagine him kicked up in the Philippines, you know, with his family, you know, tuning in to the UFC card, man, watching Connor and Dustin go at it. And could you imagine the the look on his face, bro? <laughs> when this man got TKO'd, he had to be like, God hey, damn. Hey, so so here in the US we were getting like stimulus checks. And uh -huh. I know a lot of people probably counted their money before they got it. Exactly. Yeah, back here, I was like, oh man, I'm gonna get me the this, this, I'm gonna get the people mm -hmm. this, and he looked up and and saw McGregor laid out like he was right you know, chilling in the Hamptons all over, <laughs> all over, man, slumped over. So man, so long story short, we know at this point, man, hey, Pacquiao's got to move on to Plan B. Um, it, it, it's it's not it's no way that they can make that fight right now after such a loss. Connor at this point, he needs to go back to the drawing board and really get back to the top of his sport. He did a great catch job him. of building up his name to where it has a lot sketch. of... You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? He did a go good back, job of... Go back, go back to the edge of sketch. Edge of sketch. <laughs> yeah. Hey, shake, shake it all out right. Start, start, start redrawing, huh? But, all um, that, bro. But yeah, but at the end of the day, man, he's got to go back and get to the top of his sport, you know, get back to the pinnacle. And then maybe those uh, major cross uh, sport fights will, will start to be more lucrative again. But nah, it's a wrap, bro. What you say, Q? Yeah, man. I mean... Oh boy! What did I just do? <laughs> everybody, everybody, remain well, calm. Everybody. There we go. We right there. We got your back, bro. We right. Won't he? Won't he do it? Uh -huh. So here, here we go. So here we go. So first of all, man, Mayweather comment on it, man, is really it's player hating. In this, it's player hating in this dancery. It's player, it's player hating. It's player hating. You know what I'm saying? Because I mean, you know, end of the day, man. I, I ain't really, unless Mayweather have a real, unless he has a fight, I even take an exhibition, and I heard that's been postponed. But, uh, you know, right now, Pacquiao's still out there. He's holding the belt. You know what I'm saying? He's he doing his thing, and he's still very relevant in all aspects. And he's he, all road lead to Manny Pacquiao. Like Mayweather said, all road, all road lead to Mayweather. Mayweather, you know, uh, I feel like he have issues 
seeing that, you know what I'm saying? So he'll throw some some little salt in there. But anyways, outside of that, I feel like that fight, I, I heard I, I never really had a chance to scratch too deep beneath the surface to see, but uh, heard, heard Connor, I heard that Connor said that uh, UFC is where he need to be in a way, and that's what he want to focus on. Yeah. So yeah. With, that, with that being said, I'm not sure that fight was going to be made anyway. But, uh, you know, in the day, Perrier, whatever my man name is. Yeah, that's the point. Mm-hmm. He went ahead. I'm sorry. <laughs> he went ahead and put the stamp on that. You know what I'm saying? And it gave us a whole lot to do as far as stuff <clears> to talk about. But, uh, um, you know, so that fight is dead. It ain't really, I don't really want to go any further about it. You know what I'm saying? What Pac do, what, what Pacquiao does next, mm-hmm. you know, we're waiting to see. And, um, yeah, but as far as that fight goes, I don't think it's going to happen. I, I think kind of trying to come back in May. To clean that up with the trilogy, you right. know what I'm saying? Trilogy. Mm-hmm. Oh, he got to. Will. He got to. After yeah. that, man, yeah. it, it, I think oh, he, he, he wanted it. He, yeah. he, he wanted it. He wanted uh-huh. it. And he wanted that fight. He mm-hmm. wanted to be. I will say, Connor, Connor be with smoke. He don't right. like to lose. Mm-hmm. Well, you know, I ain't seen him turn down a rematch. You know what right. I'm saying? He, he, he ready and he want to he wanna, um, clean it up. <clears> and I respect that. And um, that, him and Pat, they ain't going to happen right. at this point. Yeah. That's what I got. What do you have that, bro? Hey, I mean. look, man. <clears throat> I, I love Conor McGregor just because I love the flair he brings to you know UFC and and oh, yeah. y- you know what he did for um, uh, as far as bringing the sport to another level and then being able to cross over and really pull off a boxing match and as us as boxing heads didn't really like it counting on Floyd's re- uh, record, but. <clears throat> Yeah, it was as boxing goes, right. it was an event, and uh-huh. boxing revolves around events because there's not a league, not a league. So I, I appreciate him for that. Um, so something happened, right? And I'm not gonna, we're not gonna get too far into it, just because it's gonna be a connector with. Um, somebody posted up a fight, like, hey, you know, thank you. It's gonna be, you know, uh, uh I, I want to share the ring with you. It's a, it's a done deal. So we're not going to, you know, name because we're going to get into that a little later. But where do you think Pac goes from here? Because I, 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 it could be rumors that the fight wasn't going to happen. I think Pac, Pac was counting his money, and I think he was ready to knock out Conor McGregor and somebody just beat him to it. So wh- where does he go from here? Like, that's the real question. We've been asking this. Right. All, like, every show we do every now and then, it comes right. up. We're like, right. Cause, what cause, is Pac, you know, what is, what's that, his next cause, move? Because that's the major <clears throat> mystery, man. The, ma- the major mystery you know, behind Manny Pac-Man Pacquiao is, is he, is he going for the, the more easier lucrative fight, which, yep. which clearly yep. he was, because yep. clearly the McGregor yep. fight was in the works, <laughs> yep. you know what I mean? So now, you know, he's also back to the drawing board as far as what's his strategy going to be, you know, does he look for, you know, maybe a lighter, a lighter weight division or a lighter weight champ? That you know wouldn't be a real tough fight for him that he probably would be favored in that could generate you know some fun or does he go for the big fish? And now after after hearing all the speculation that the counter fight really was set if he would have won, I gotta lie I'm, I, I can't lie I'm I'm starting to lean more and more like he's definitely not fighting definitely not fighting Bud or Spence. I, I, I'm kind of starting <clears throat> to get to that point where I don't think he names Bud or Spence as his opponent. What you got on that? Cube? It, I think. I think you're probably exactly right uh, as, far as, <laughs> as far as far as the next fight. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because one thing, one thing, and this was me in that situation. What I do is secure the biggest bag, right? The biggest bag for the less risk first. Get the most money with the less risk, and then after I got that bag, I see how I feel. You know what I'm saying? I I see how I feel while I'm counting that count them M's. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And sitting back doing what I'm doing, and I go from there. If if if, if, if legacy and if I if I feel like I still want to climb high on Mount Olympus. You know what I'm saying? I'm still relevant. I'm still holding the strap. I, I, you know, I, 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 I leave that to, to however I feel at the time. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But first, I'm gonna secure this bag first because I mean, what he 42? Yeah. He just turned 40, yeah. He just turned 42. I, I, so I mean, he don't he don't have to prove anything to anybody. I mean, he could fight anybody he want to fight. You know, he could fight Chris the Klein at this point. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Real talk. Heck yeah, I've done things no other human being has done. So, right. so you know what I'm saying? That bri- I'm glad you said that. One. I'm glad go, you go. said that.